Alrighty, here we are. So who are you and uh, where are you from? Yeah, no worries, Simon. Thanks for stopping by. I'm Alex Almeida. I'm a Senior Technical Marketing Manager with EMC's Backup and Recovery Systems Division. Specifically, I concentrate mostly on EMC's Avamar uh, product. Right, excellent. Now, uh, you guys have had some uh, exciting new releases recently. Do you want to just take us through what those are? Absolutely. Uh, earlier this year, we announced uh, EMC Avamar 6.1 release, which is an updated release to follow on release to our 6.0 release. has a lot of uh, more enhanced features for VMware backup, specifically virtualized backup. And there's been a lot of, of cool things that have come out of our labs uh, utilizing a lot of those features to extend our capabilities into protecting things like vCloud Director and other VMware uh, virtualization suite products. Oh, wow, that's, pre that's pretty good. Do you want to just take us through some of those, uh, you know, some, some of those exceptions, Absolutely. for example? Yeah, yeah. So some of the things in, in Avmar 6.1 that we've introduced is the ability for customers to have access to a CLI interface to actually orchestrate and automate a lot of the uh, virtualization backup that they're doing to, with Avamar today. Um, so a lot of things is uh, making user scripts that can be uh, leveraged at CLI, but really a lot of the power that we, we thought about in the lab is that we could actually extend that and combine it together with VMware's uh, Power CLIs, example, and our PowerShell, and be able to actually orchestrate and automate vCloud Director backups using current release product with Avamar today. Right. Yeah, so what we, we can do is actually query uh, vCloud Director vApps, um, be able to and, and query the catalog um, to be able to build the exact structure of the vApps within Avamar backup policies. Oh, that's powerful stuff. Exactly, so as you know, Avamar is already best in class uh, virtualization backup for VMs in the industry, and we back up at the vSphere layer. In fact, we're, uh, most of our interaction is with the VADP APIs within VMware's vSphere product. Oh, okay, that's great um, stuff, because, uh, you know, VCD, yeah. you know, historically, so far, has been quite hard to back up. Absolutely. You know, you know if you're running VCD, great product, right? Absolutely. Really hard to back up your VM, so. Yeah, VCD is definitely, uh, it's another abstraction layer on top of vSphere, right, that further makes it easier for um, IT administrators to deploy applications across the enterprise uh, with certain SLAs. The key that we did with the CLI and basically the new features in 6.1 is to be able to extend that so that customers can actually work to build, um, you know, backup portals that for themselves to be able to orchestrate and execute backups at the vApp container level, not just the VM level. Wow, that's, yeah. that's pretty powerful Absolutely, stuff. absolutely. Excellent. Good so, stuff. Yeah, that's brilliant. So, uh, FMR 6.1, definitely worth downloading, trying out, especially if you're running VCD there. Definitely. So, uh, one thing I can I, I can say is reach out to your uh, EMC representatives, sales teams. Um, they can get you, uh, you know, proof of concepts, test it out in your environment, really start to talk to you about your particular needs and uh, get you the right solution. That sounds fantastic. So yep, absolutely. Brilliant. Alex, thank you very much. No worries, Simon. Anytime. Pleasure.